Welcome back into our playthrough of Baldur Gate, Baldur's Gate 3. Again, I'm FTA Reaper, and just a quick reminder, if you like this kind of content, you like D&D, I do stream it every Saturday night. There's going to be a link in the description if you want to click on that to see uh, that campaign, which is entirely homebrewed. We'd love to have you and love to have you uh, in as part of the community, so that'd be kind of cool. Uh, we're going to pick right up where we've left off. This time, I will be reading a little bit more of my character's responses. Uh, just so it's not left out. Since it's in pre-alpha phase, again, things are going to be a little rusty. Uh, there's not a lot of reading um, from the character, so again, I'm going to do some of that just to make sure that you keep up with the story and you don't have to like pause it and keep going back. So, uh, just picking up, if you need to, there is a uh, link, and it should be up above me, uh, to the rest of the playlist if you want to start from episode one. So, let's get right into it. Alright. Let's see how these loading screens go. Again, they're a little long. I don't feel like they're too bad, but they're a little bit longer than I was kind of hoping. Still, the game's in pretty good shape. It looks pretty good even for an alpha. I, I had no problems with it for the couple hours I've already put into it at this point, so at this point, I'd say it's pretty decent. Let's start by talking to a couple of our companions here. Believe it or not, but I witnessed a similar standoff back at the Yawning Portal. Of course, an establishment like that invites all sorts of outlandish entertainments. We'll ask him what the Yawning Portal is. An inn in Waterdeep. Ooh, never a dull moment there. Adventurers come from all over Faerun to try their luck down the well. Leads into the Undermountain, you see. Full of death, danger, vast amounts of treasure. Hard to resist. Hmm. Alright, let's ask him what the standoff was about. Oh, a drow, a dragonborn, and a cleric of Cyric walk into a bar. Your standard fare. Maybe someone was cheating at cards. Maybe it was some weird lover's quarrel. In any case, out came the crossbow, and a hush fell over the entire room. Uh, let's ask him what happened next. I stood up and yelled, Shadow Dark Ale for everyone. The crowd cheered. Tension drained into five dozen tankards, and soon all was well again. In a place like the Yawning Portal, the most powerful magic is calling for a round of drinks. Mind you, all I did was call for ale, but you went and stood in front of that crossbow. What? He'd drink to that, all right. Let's go ask our other companion. Forget this goblin priestess. She will not know about purification. Now, I do kind of agree with her. I think it's kind of a uh, dead end, but I'm going to say, don't you think it's best to explore all of our options? A change is coming. I do not know the day. I do not know if it will be sun up, sundown, or at afternoon's high. But it is coming. And every unnecessary option we explore is another toll of the bell. Relax, baby. I'm the main character. We'll be fine. All right. Um... It's pickable. You're gonna be sorry. Whoops. Every last one of ya. Oh, okay. All right. Just want to make sure we didn't aggro people by uh by clicking on that. That's okay. I don't know that we can get down here, but we might be able to jump. Perception failed, huh? We just missed something. If we can make a jump again. Might be a dead end. Let's see what happened to the rest of the party. 
Well, it's good to know that probably was a secret over here somewhere, and we just didn't have a high enough perception check to get there, so... It's okay. We'll move back. Let's see if coming back over here triggers it. And I'm pretty sure I am proficient in that, too, so... Let me out, you bunch of softies! We'll keep going. Is that everything? I think that's everything. Hmm. So some of this seems like it'll aggro them if I, uh, if I click on it. Some of it doesn't. I guess we're just welcome to the grapes, okay. What do we have? Rum, alright. Thanks for the free stuff. Let's talk to this guy. By Mordai's eyes, another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? I'm gonna say you heard the woman bow. Not even an intimidation check, huh? Okay. Lower. Uh, we'll say she's serious. You better get on your knees fast. You saw another gift. Where? On the road to Baldur's Gate, N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. The map. Show me. Up. You can keep your innards. Now we are going to switch out our party because again this wizard is almost identical to the one that I've spawned so uh, we are going to drop him in a minute but first uh, we're going to try to do some other stuff because I don't think it's time sensitive but we're going to treat it like it's time sensitive that uh, you know we have these parasites kind of growing in our heads so we'll continue on Let's see what this is. Let my daughter go right now! She's a thief, hell spawn. And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Radrasham, or I'll rip your damn throat out! Alright, so there's it. our druids. We could have taken those gods. I'd rather you not get eaten by a bear. Stop! Move back at once! We'll say, if it weren't for me, you'd be overrun by goblins now. I will go where I Take please. Back. Force my hand, and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Oh. I understand. You. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. All right. Okay. I see a cork winning, so... I'm sure I'm not interrupting anything, we'll just walk right up. behind the stone door here. Madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? 
I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Alright. We'll go with thief, poison. What's this girl's Girl? actual crime? You mean parasite? She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Mm. Alright, we'll go with nature. Don't druids cherish harmony? Jailing the girl disrupts nature's balance. Ooh, that's a tough one. I don't think we're getting this through because I don't have any proficiency in nature for sure. Oh, whoops. Alright. The devil sowed chaos. She remains until the rite is complete. Should have went persuasion. Now, Wrath. Although with the four, I don't know that we're getting it through on that either. No. Stand by and let that happen. By the gods, Korga, what have you done? Atheus! Tila to me! <laughs> Bury the remains. Continue the rite. And the parents? They're just outside. This outsider will take word once I've spoken to him. We must focus on the right. Spare your tears. I was gonna say, I have a scroll of Revivify, but Go I don't on. think it's gonna work. Say it. You think I'm a monster? I'm gonna go with yes. <laughs> Say, do you expect pity? You killed a child in cold blood. She made her choice. I know your kind. You see only victims and villains. A viper bears her fangs defending her brood. I call her mother. You call her monster. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus and the writers resumed. We will seal the grove. Free from harm. Free of intruders. We'll say Zevlor believes his people will perish on the road. And mine perish if he stays. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Zevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If the Viper must strike. All right, we'll say that it seems I'd best speak with Zephyr. You Zephlor. will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander rot cleansed and the grove forever shrouded. And if it comes to a fight? We'll talk to this guy. Mercy on us, Sylvanus. Mercy. 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 Alright, we'll say a child is dead. You don't deserve mercy. You may mercy. be right. We've let a snake replace our leader. And the result, by the tree father. That girl. Kaga seems happy to rule the roost. Who's your real leader? Master Holson. Perhaps Goblin Court? Perhaps dead. He'd set Mistress Korga back in line. Hold her to task. Stop this damn ritual. More will die if the rite is finished. So many more sent into a world gone mad. No one's looking for Halston. I could do it. I'm looking for Nettie. Ah, I see. You will find her deeper in the caves. We'll offer our help. Would you? 
Seems like a I would give pretty peaceful to see return resolution home. to this conflict. So we'll go with that. Like a solid, more solid offer than anything. Uh, we'll stay. We'll walk the straight and narrow. So we'll say no need to fret. I'll find. Sylvanas's blessing upon you, and my gratitude as well. Okay. Hulsin is an elf with the presence of a bear. He left west with the adventurers. You won't mistake the first druid for anyone else. All right. Let's go see if we can get healing, but I get the feeling it's not going to be so simple. I didn't. I see you. Just give me a moment. I'll ask if there's anything I can do to help. A moment. This medicatrix. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now. What was it you needed? I'm looking for Nettie. You found her. But I still don't know what she can do for you. Uh, we'll go with healing as soon Come as here. possible. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. Uh, not a good way of putting this. I have a tadpole in my head. A tadpole? A mind flare tadpole? Uh, <laughs> well, so you know of them? Can you help I, me? Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. You All need right. To be quick. This way. Head on in. Dissected drow, huh? Okay. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. say I'm hoping for a less grave cure. I'll do the best I can. I'm no master Halson, mind. He'd have your tadpole out like that. Still, we have options. Give me your arm, please. You don't we'll just have hold out to our be arm. here for this. I will remain. I have a vested interest in the outcome. There. Be careful. Your legs will probably give out first. All right. We'll say, wait, my legs? What kind of cure is this? I'm sorry. Maybe Master Halson could have plucked it from your head. But I can't. Without him here, the only treatment for an illithid tadpole is death. You're a risk oh, to the people good. around you. I'm truly, truly sorry. For what it's worth, the poison is painless. It'll be That's like very not see. good. We'll say, give me the antidote now. I can't risk you turning. You'd kill us all. Uh, we'll say, give me the goddamn I antidote. Won't. I can't. All right. We'll go with intimidation. Give me the antidote, or I'll tear this place apart. Let's see how this goes. Nine. Ooh, barely hit it. All right. I understand you're angry. I really do. But I won't let you endanger these people. Mm -hmm. But I'm safe, I'm not showing symptoms, and it's been days. We'll give it a shot. Alright, there we go, we hit another one. We're on a roll. Same as the drow. But Master Halson said he'd turn eventually. Uh, ch -ch -ch. We'll go persuasion again. You said I still have time. Let me use it. 
we go. Three for three. All right. All right. Master Halson did say the drow's tadpole was dormant. Maybe yours is too. But first, this is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. I, I swear. hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here, and here's the antidote. Do not mix those two up. I know you're not changing yet, and I've no idea why not. But we have to assume it's only a matter of time. You must understand, you are in grave danger. You have to find Master Hals. He might be your only chance. We'll ask if he killed that drow because he was going to turn. Oh, no. He would have slit me navel to nape if Master Halson hadn't put him down. The drow was leading a gang of goblins. Not a common pairing. They attacked us. We had to defend ourselves. It's only after we saw the tadpole crawling out of his head that Master Halson realized how serious things were. Uh, we'll ask where you know... Well, what makes you think... What makes you so sure Halson can help me? Master Halson's a renowned healer. He studied the drow's tadpole for days and concluded he needed to find the source of the infection to understand its nature. We can only hope he succeeded in his mission. Otherwise, that vial's your only option. Well, ask where he, know, ask she knows the where he is. Ask the adventurers that abandoned him. They're the only ones who know Pretty what sure we really know happened where that is, so. There. All I know is they went to the old temple of Saluna, and he didn't make it back. Okay. Remember what I said. Thanks for trying to kill me. Remember we'll get out of here. Oath. Take it one step at a time, Nettie. Come on. All right, where is... I can't believe she poisoned you. Tried to put you down like a dying dog without so much as a whisper of consent. We'll say the only dead dog would have been her if she hadn't given in. A taste of her own medicine is what she deserves. How dare she snuff out life with as much thought as snuffing out a bloody candle. Uh, we'll ask him if he's all right. Are you all right, Gail? Yes. Yes, I am. It's just that, had it been me, had it been, but you handled it. You handled it well. As for myself, I could quite do with a tumbler full of water-deep whiskey. Anyway, we live for the moment. How about we go find that chap Halsin, little Miss Poison Ivy mentioned. With a bit of luck, he has the means to offer us a cure rather than a coffin. Poison? Never. I shall slit my own throat if it comes to that. Uh, we'll say it won't come to that. We'll find a cure soon Boundless enough. Boundless annoying optimism. I respect you for it. We must assume purification is at hand. Anything else is surrender. Let us make haste to a crash then. Neither Nettie nor Halston holds the cure we seek. I think she might be right, so we might maybe go take a look at her uh, side of the quest. Walk all the way out this way. Oh, I can throw her. Okay, perfect. When the goblins came, you saw them up close? 
A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Yeah, all right, we'll say fine, ask your questions. Glory. Now then, how would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind, but remember nothing useful about goblin social order or behavior. Now we'll give an exact description as best I can. Goblins were of rare gem-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. A mythweaver. This man has no respect for truth. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver <laughs> variety? Mm, we'll say that uh, it was brass, no doubt about it. Actually, we're going to ask him what he's actually truth, up to. The truth, my friend. Not a jot, more or less. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Hmm. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Mm, we'll say yes. They called out that name like it was some they sort of did, war cry. They didn't they? Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one. A captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglabiot, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal. <laughs> All right, we'll say sca uh, scandal. Pretty petty drama, maybe. Petty? Since their change in allegiance, these goblins are informed by a kind of strategy anathema to their kind. I, for one, Intend to get to the bottom of it. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, in fact. If you'll excuse me, I ought not to dawdle. Uh, we'll say be careful, goblin goblins aren't known for mercy. Never you mind. We're gonna go save him here in a minute, I bet you. Tongue and an invisibility potion stashed in one's back pocket. Until we meet again. Yeah, we'll see. I get the feeling we're about to save him. That's gonna Follow along the quest line. It's okay. What am I supposed to be doing here? Is there anything out this way? I think this just leads away. Yeah, we'll go back in. All right. Unless you have news of Arabella, I don't want to hear it. All right, I'm just going to tell her the truth. She was bitten by a snake, happened quickly, felt no Wait, pain. What? What are you saying? Your daughter is dead. Uh, I will say Arabella is gone. I'm sorry for your loss. Don't be ridiculous. What are you on about? Uh... I'll say, believe me or don't, it won't bring your daughter back. Look, it's not true. Look! Please. Is Arabella all right? Mm. I'll say, she's dead. I'm sorry. No! Look! Look! Sorry, fa failed the uh, persuasion check. What can you, what can you do? forward Zevlor. We'll, we'll talk to him really quick before we leave, too. I've already heard Arabella. Nine summers old. And now she'll never see another. Because of druid law. Every natural law demands I take up my sword, storm their lair, and... But no. That's what Korga wants. To prove we are exactly what she says. A threat. I won't give her the satisfaction. 
I'll get my people clear of this, but on our terms. Mm. Can you delay the ritual? You saw what they did to Arabella for trying. A child. It's Corga's influence. Without her twisting things, I believe the druids might see sense. Yeah, all right. So why don't you get rid of her? A thought I might have dismissed before Arabella. But the druids would slaughter us. We'd have to get close to Corga, within striking distance. I can't manage that. But they've already let you pass once. Mm, I'm not some murderer for hire, I think we'll say. If the issue is coin, I'll ensure you're well rewarded. But if you believe Corga deserves your compassion after what she's done, there's nothing more to discuss. All right. You're the one who helped at the gate. Glad to have another sword. <sighs> we might need it. Well, I don't actually have a sword, but I get the idea. Uh, we'll go. Is that a set of stairs? Doesn't look like it. How do I get out and around here? Doesn't look like there's a good way out. Okay. Looks like there's a path up here, but... Hmm. Let's actually go back inside really quick. I want to see what that other objective was, Zevlor. Priestess Gut. Oh, is that on the other side? That's on the other side. Okay. That's why I can't get there. Not sure why they'd have it show up on the map in this chamber, but alright. It's okay. It's still an alpha. We're not gonna... We're not gonna sweat it. Just keep moving. Alright. Continue on here in just a second. First, take a quick look at the map. Can we fast travel? Entrance to the ruins there. I think we'll do that. We'll go out this way. Can I fast travel here? No. It's a waypoint, but it doesn't let you travel. Oh, wait, no. Here you go. Okay. Roadside cliffs. We'll do that. These tieflings prove fragile. I have a mind to end their misery myself. All right. We're also going to camp, because I'm going to try to switch out. Calm yourself. All right. Let's survive... Didn't want to end the day, but we do need to uh, switch out our other mage, who's not supremely helpful for our other, uh, the other guy we just met. My, my, what manner of place is this? A patch of ground to call home. Some rest for the wicked, after all. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. I just blink through his eyelids. Words to a lullaby, perhaps. The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that love was that. <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormir, don't they? Well met, I am Raphael. Very much at your service. Am I talking to the mouse or the cat? Neither. The fox, rather. Hiding, in a word. A silent observer about to break the silence. Of course, what I have to say merits some privacy, as well as some more, let's call it, refinement. Yes, this encampment is decidedly to middle of nowhere for my tastes. Come. All right. There, middle of somewhere. You say nice to go. The call. house of hope, where the tired come to rest and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might 
just be your last. We're getting some distinct vampire vibes from this guy. Uh, Are all these theatrics leading somewhere? <laughs> Are you not entertained? Well, far be it from me to disappoint. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary? Conceivably. But a savior? That's for certain. Well, I was thinking vampires a demon. Okay. We'll say, why would you help me? Because my compassion is boundless. I stride among the needy, giving comfort where I can. And you're in dire need. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. Say, you're mad if you think I'll, I'll make a deal with the devil. And what is madness but a denial of reality? Still, I have a feeling you change your mind before it's changed for you. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, that's when you'll come knocking on my door. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. Mm. We'll say I'll have the last laugh in the end. <laughs> I've always wondered what a laughing mind flayer sounds like. All those pretty little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. All right. Speak here. Bloody hells. Literally. Just when I think I've got a grasp on our dilemma, a devil shows up. <sighs> no matter. We've dealt with every other oddity thrown at us lately. We can handle this one too. Now, as for this Raphael, he knows our secret. He claims he can help. What do you make of him? Mm. <laughs> We'll go with wisdom here. We'll take a shot here. Seventeen. All right. Anticipation. She is testing you somehow about Raphael. We'll say he's a devil. We shouldn't trust him. Simple as that. That's exactly what the cleric's no gonna want to hear. He seemed powerful and very knowledgeable about our problem. Not the worst prospect we've stumbled across. As long as you can look past what he is. We'll say, I'm not going to change. All right, we'll, we'll ask her. We'll say, enough about me. What do you think is best? I'll tell you in due course. I just wanted to see how close we are in thinking, first of all. I'll say, I'm not going to... I'm not going to just change my mind. We can't trust Raphael, Good. which of course, that comes That's with cost, so we're not going to do I it. I know people who work we'll much like our new acquaintance does. You don't need a scourge or a rack to break people. Fear and self-doubt is sufficient. When actual pain comes, the victim's already done the heavy lifting for their torturer. There were no right answers with that devil. He was toying with his food. Us.
I'll say, I think I detected a note of admiration in your voice. I respect his craft. As should you. Watch out for that devil. All right. Now then. Let's see. How do we switch? How oh, do we level up? We did. All right. I didn't pick my spells. That's not good. Okay. Let's see what you got. Prayer of healing. That's not bad. We'll keep healing word just because it's so cheap to run. Especially with her being a uh, cleric. I don't think we need create water. We'll go with... Uh, let's see. Okay, we'll definitely add the prayer of healing. What else do we have? We'll skip that. It'll be okay. We'll go with hold person, too. Okay. All right. That should be good. We'll level up our wizard as well. Tech thoughts might not be bad. Blur will be good for keeping him alive. I know we're not really worried about him. Since he won't stay with the party for long, I'll miss his step though. Yeah, we'll go Misty Step. Uh, yeah. We're definitely going to add Scorching Ray, too. Okay. There we go. We should have a little bit hard hitting there. Customize his prepared spells. We'll go Goodbye Fog Cloud, Scorching Ray. Drop Switch Bolt, since we now have our new Distance spell. Doesn't need Grease. We'll add Burning Hands in case somebody gets close to us. All right. And she sh um yeah, we're going to make her a battle master for sure. Let's see what spells did I get stuck with. We will keep ma mage armor. I'll drop that. We'll also add magic missile, I guess. So that way we get our automatic hit if we need it. Uh, we've got Thunder Wave for crowds. We've got Sleep for crowds as well, so we're a little redundant on that. Um, yeah. Yeah, we'll drop... No, I'm going to stick with Thunder Wave. We'll drop Sleep. Because as we start running into more powerful enemies, it'll be harder to put them all to sleep, so... We'll pass on all that. Okay. Now, how do we mess with the party? Um, hmm. 
is this? Oh, there we go. see a dismiss button, so we might just be rolling with him. Unfortunately. That's okay. Alright. Oh, here he is. Salutations. I'd like you to join Make me. Make some room, and I'm all yours. Well, some yours. Do you feel as flattered as I do? A Cambion came courting us. Mm. Well, first we'll ask him if he was a Cambion, was he? That makes him half human. Quite right. Either Daddy had a tryst with a succubus or Mummy with an incubus. What they lack in kind-heartedness, they make up for with horns and tails. Still, don't let his bluster fool you. All that talk of desperation it merely illustrates his own. I think he wants something from us, badly. And in that knowledge lies our opportunity. Okay. But what is it that this devil wants so very badly? Our souls. But I suspect that's but his opening offer. Let me play the devil deals advocate. The man is too eager. Do not dismiss his offer out of hand. All right, but I need you to leave. Go ahead. I'm listening. There we go. I question the wisdom of that decision, but so be it. All right. I'll be here in the meantime, idling away the hours. Yeah, that's good. I think we need more front line, so the we'll add him. with the silver tongue, an old fairy tale my father read to me. The kind with a hero, a villain, and a moral. A farmer made a deal with the devil, so the story goes. In exchange for the farmer's dearest fruit, the devil granted him a bottomless coin purse. The farmer's dearest fruit, naturally, was no apple nor peach, but his beloved daughter. We can learn a lot from fairy tales, don't you think? I say, spare, spare me the parables. I've no intention of bargaining with the likes of him. That's because you still have hope, but when he becomes your last hope, remember this. He'll require of you what you're least ready to part with. And then require more still. You might think you'd give up anything for a cure, but the devil won't take just anything. He'll take everything. Well met. All right. We'll ask him about his eye first, then we'll ask him Now, now, I always save the best stories for my closest friends and my cruelest enemies. Get to be one of those, and I'll spill the whole jug. Hmm? You get that, right? Spill the whole jug? <laughs> huh. I guess I'll toss that one in the heap. All right. Tiny grooves spider across the eye's surface. It resembles a sending stone used to confer with distant contacts. Well, ask him, isn't your eye a sending stone? <laughs> a, a what now? Goodness, but it's just a bit of rock. Nothing so special, I assure you. You watch and listen for signs of deceit, but sense nothing unusual. Okay. Well, ask him to join him now. Ah, that's the spirit. No, he might be reporting to somebody else. We'll level him up. Is he a fighter or is he... Oh, he's a warlock. Okay. Subclass, the fiend. All right. Let's bring him on. Well met. We don't need to talk to him. Just level them up another couple times. Set. All right. I might have just spammed through his spells. He might have had a choice there, but it's okay. 
again, with him being a warlock, I know he's a hexblade warlock. We're probably not going to keep him around too long because we're going to look for somebody who's a little bit more uh, front centric. We've got, we should have enough spellcasters with both the wizard I'm playing and the cleric. Uh, you know, we have a fighter with the, the Yankee, and then we've got a warlock now that's probably a little bit more of, you know, a half and half, or he can be a spellcaster as well as a. Uh, frontline guy if he needs to be, so we'll keep going for now, but we're still going to keep our eyes out. I'd like to get a rogue or another frontline character, but we'll see how that goes. Oh, I think we have to go back down. Um, well, no, I remember we are supposed to go up these cliffs. Okay. Not certain we know who that is. Oh, okay, we're just going to fight. Thing that failed. Okay, and of course we've jammed all that up. Uh, I guess we'll just dash. Well, her turn here. My guy is going to cast. We have sickness here. Okay, perfect. Then we're gonna take a step back behind this wall and try to hide behind it. All right, that should do it. Our cleric is gonna shove that. Oh, okay, thought he'd fly off with that, but okay, that's all right. Should have been our action, right? Oh no, it was our bonus action. Okay, then we're just gonna attack him. Another miss. Go for her. Then our warlock. Let's see, we have Eldritch Blast. Not bad. Okay. That's Bane. Two with me. That should slow them down when they get here. Because so obviously we're not going to finish this guy off before that happens. But we'll stay on either side of him. Oh, and he broke concentration with that too. Perfect. So there goes our Bane that we just cast. She missed, but it's still burning her. Okay. In that case, we'll move out of that. Where's she at on health? Okay, she's, she's still fine. We're still going to attack. Not a big deal. Uh, that is a bonus action, so we'll... Yeah, we'll burn her second wind. Why not? Alright, good. She's back to full health. I'll do it for her turn. I don't want to thunder wave my party either, so... Recast my magic missile. How much health does this guy have? 12, 18. Alright, so I do need to move first. Can you see now? Target is too what? Let's step out here, I guess. Cast magic missile. All four of them will throw it here. Perfect. Drop back. That's gonna do it for me. Next, our cleric. Once per short rest. Not crazy about that either. No, we're not gonna. We're gonna guiding bolt instead. Oh, that close. Not such a great thing. We're just going to attack him, I think. Ooh, an 11. Alright, we're going to have to watch out for him. Alright. We're 
around here. Let's see. Take the crew. And then we'll main hand attack now that we've missed it. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Move Shadow Heart. This way. I feel like you should have got an opportunity to attack there, but okay. We'll main hand attack this guy, see if we can get him out of the fight. No. Alright. Not the end of the world. We're actually, we're gonna action surge, try to hit him again. Alright, that'll do it for her. We'll just burn first level magic missile, I think. Only has two health left, so we'll throw one of those at him. And throw. Can I reach that far? I can't. It's alright, we'll throw the other two at this guy. There we go. Perfect. And again, we're gonna go hide like a coward behind the pillar because we're a wizard and we're not trying to get hit. Uh... Since we're next to him, we'll just throw an attack. Bad eight. We'll end the turn for her. I could, probably could have healed her, but it's alright. Ah. Yeah, we don't need to hex again. He's already burned his spell slots anyway, so. Here with her. This one's probably gonna be on me. Cross over there. We have cast ray of sickness here. Good. Now I'm gonna stay here with my guy, which is fine. Tracking blood. I see what that's. And then she's gonna cast. She can only be cast outside, so she'll cast healing word on herself. Okay. My friend here. We'll run him forward. Same deal. He's out of spell slot, so let him be. Rally as a bonus action here. Cast it on him. That should let him regain some hit points. And then we're gonna dash just to get closer. We're gonna get all the way on this side. And that'll do it. Um hmm. Eldritch Blast for him, Stop. Warlock. Go to Old Faithful, and he missed. Okay. Uh, I think I'm actually going to retreat with him. Just get him out of the line of sight there. Can I see her? I can't see her. Okay. So first we'll move. Hopefully I can see her from here, but I might not be able to. Path is interrupted, yeah. Alright, that's okay. Uh, we'll just save it. We'll end my turn. And she will dash as well. Alright. Cast okay, so another healing word here on myself. Do it. And there we go. Perfect. It, and they walk through the fire to rejoin the party. Okay, good job, guys. Oh. 
Just drink a bunch of healing, I guess. What do you got? Scroll of mage armor, scroll of shocking grasp, some gold. Uh, we'll switch over to my guy and take it. Check our other three kills up here, and then we'll take a short rest, try to recover some of this, uh, some of this health. What is this? Fine stone carving often found at the base of volcanoes, huh? Scale mail armor as well. We'll take it. Leather armor on him. Thieves tools, well, this is obviously a rogue, okay. More leather armor. All right, we'll take all that too. All right, let's go to our equipment really quick. We won't spend long here, but um, thinking. Got the leather armor. Where was the scale mail at? Did I not take it? Am I wearing it? I might have put it on. Not have proficiency with long swords. Okay, how about the? Sh she might be able to use a short bow too, which she might already have one. Yeah, she does. Okay. Did I just not take that then? I guess I didn't take it. Okay. We'll go to equipment again, and we'll see if she can use the scale mail. Oh, this is already better. All right, never mind. All right, so we'll, let's let's pause and take a short rest. Okay, it automatically just rolls your dice. I see. Switching back to my character here. Spellcaster too. I don't think we checked. Oh yeah, we did. Hmm. Doesn't look like there's anything up here. That's okay. Okay, this is hitting him. Why don't we come down here and attack this? Oh, you can't. Alright, he's free of it. Alright, don't go in there. Don't go in there. Stop. Okay, cool. Meanwhile, I just walked everybody back through it because this game is awesome. Okay, cool. Can we go... Can't go around. Alright, everybody come out this way. Meanwhile, they keep walking through it. Perfect. Okay. All right. Thank you, Gibblebock. Everything all right out there? Hmm. 
We'll go with Deception here. Oh, of course, we got the wrong character, too. I'm just gonna leave. Come back with my guy. Actually, let me check my stats here for that. Character sheets. We got a plus two. How about you? No, oh, he's pretty good at it. He's got a plus three. So we'll we'll go with him. Thank you, Gibblebock. Everything all right out there? So he triggered a trap. Let's see how he does here. All right, he got it. Oh, I told him it wasn't safe out there. Get inside, and I'll rustle up some bandages. Okay. So we did surprise him, so that's good at least. Uh, now, this close Eldritch Blast is not going to hit. We'll cast Armor of Agathis here. It's a bonus action. I don't think we need to cast Hex, so we're good. Can't reach destination. Okay, that's okay. We'll switch to our range. And we miss. As far as I go, cast Ray of Frost here, trying to keep him getting away. Critical miss. Alright, that's okay. At least we knocked him prone. Then she's just gonna walk up and club the hell out of him. A three while he's on the ground. Okay, good good roll. Good rolls. Good rolls. Uh, we'll end here. At this point, the push is going to gang up on him here, I think. And he falls right back over. Perfect. Nice shot. Uh, honestly, I'm just going to walk up and whack him. I know it's not really a whole lot, but that's okay. We'll take the <laughs> We'll cheese the kill. Why not? Bandit's key. Does anyone not have dark vision? That's a good question. I think just about everybody should. shift the whole party into it, too. Oh, yeah, I need to give her that arrow of acid, too. All right. Doesn't really matter who's carrying all this. Uh, I don't think she needs a shield, though, does she? No.
There's just no wall here, but there's a door. Use jump to reach. She obviously doesn't have dark vision, I see. Okay. I'll just make sure everybody's hiding. Key does not go to this door. All right, we'll try it. That's okay. We'll move on somewhere else. There is another way through, right? Shelves. Take the candles. Hmm. Nothing here either. Opulent chest has plates in it. Ancient, indecipherable text covers the plaque. Okay. Not a big deal. Dead tongue. Whoever worshipped here must be long gone. Same deal. It's a little disappointing. I can't open the door. Oh, there's a lever right here. Okay. So I guess we'll just uh, let everybody know that we're coming. our friend here, right here. Ah. Alright. Why is it just my guy? I guess it's about to not matter, but still. Going with my other character, that doesn't make any sense. Well, obviously, I wasn't hiding as a party. Alright. Basic poison, thieves' tools, gold. I'll take all of it. I don't think anything's worth a whole lot of anything to my characters, but that's okay. Can I just pick up a whole barrel? Oh, it's an 
oil barrel. That's why we took it. Okay. We'll continue on. Okay, just the two of them, though. Why? I've split the party somehow, even though everybody's standing right there. That's a little cheesy. I mean, at that point, you can just sneak ahead with one person and get three free attacks on everybody every time. Not not crazy about that. We'll cast Sacred Flame, because it is just a cantrip. Make a save. He did. All right. Not the end of the world. On to my guy again. Hmm. Don't have a lot of spells, but... Mage armor. Just so we don't die. And then I'm gonna move back a little bit because I'm sure he's gonna come forward. And we'll leave the Gith Yankee there in the middle. That should be good. Oh, there's a third guy. Okay. Uh nice kill. We need to action surge this turn. Mm. He's healing. Right, we'll go with him. Rally him, and we'll end our turn. Another ball. Good miss. Alright. Oh, there's a spellcaster, too. Okay. Well, now we know who we're targeting. Step forward with him. out of the way. We'll go Eldritch Blast. Nice. Alright, good for him. Back to my guy. Step forward. I don't need to block this door, though. I burned, I, of course, I burned all my move. Okay, well. Looks like she's not going. We'll slow him down. He saved again. sort of worried about oh, she's not oh she's stunned or something threatened oh disadvantage that's why okay um don't really want to take the opportunity attack moving she doesn't need to make she doesn't need to do that I don't need to burn that again once per short rest she's full health Disengage. Yeah, let's disengage. Alright. Then we're gonna go around the corner here. Where did our other friend go? Oh, there she is. Can I attack? Is she out of range? It's too far. on her, 25 on him, okay. She's still threatened, huh? Okay. That'll do it for her. Yeah. She can't move through, that's okay. Hopefully if she gets behind me, she'll still be able to cast Sacred Flame. Seven to him, good. Uh, nobody's hurt bad enough to need a healing word, so we'll end our turn. On to our friend here. How are you doing? Okay. Target's obscured, that's why, by the shadows. Okay.
just take a move over here actually and then we'll just take an Elbridge blast shot even though it's not good Done. all right then with my character gonna keep casting. there's cantrips yep there it is all right and then we'll move in here with him Probably won't be able to see her and that'll still hurt him, but it's okay. I'm just gonna move out this way. Another cantrip. She saved too. Okay. It's alright. Got our main attack. This should finish it. Or we'll dismiss, which is fine. I'll move over here and end our turn. Ooh. healing word on him, but that's alright. Alright, let's see what kind of good stuff Something they have. Something in the matter. No. Just move together as a party. I know we want a stealth. How about our wizard? What do you have? Scroll of animal friendship. Quarter staff. I think I've already got one of those. Yep. Got all that. That's okay. How about our friend over here? Great club, huh? How about we switch over to her? Fourth one that died here somewhere right away. Do I remember where that is? No. It's okay, we'll go check this chest. We're also gonna cast a prayer of healing, I think. Just to keep everybody up. Alright, not bad. He still needs help, but I don't think it's worth casting another one. Well met. Not what I wanted. All right, onto the chest. Nothing. Put over here. That might be worth a look. What did we perceive? Not the lever. Just to make sure we're not missing out on anything. Uh, I wonder if I give him a torch. Should probably do that. Because I have one, right?
We'll unequip it since he's not proficient. Uh. Okay. Nothing in our row of books. A lot of books, a lot of junk. sides. We'll test the side. Actually, we'll hit this chest first, but this might be trapped. No, huh? Okay. Alright, cool enough. Continue on. Maybe the side's open. It is. Alright. Walk in with my dark vision again. I should probably just leave with the cleric. Look. Watcher's guard, huh? Alright, the watcher's guide. Hmm. Yeah, see, I figured that was trap. Oh, it's grease. Okay. Laying down might not be a bad thing, actually. Why is everything exploding? Start with that. You keep 
moving? No? Oh, that must be the end of his turn. Alright. She's burning as well. We'll burn another health potion. Don't want to, but better than having the whole party here die. We'll dash too. We'll go out and around. Hopefully I don't step through anything there. Okay. Cool. I'll do it for her. She's just in the middle of it. Alright, well, we'll just run right through. Use jump to reach. Okay. Alright. I kind of figured the, the grease was going to explode too, but it's okay. And then he'll dash, and we'll end our turn. <laughs> There you go. What's that? <laughs> All right, we'll do another prayer of healing if I have a spell. I do. She got a six, but everyone else did okay. Oh, okay. Alright, I see that it's locked. Do any of my keys work with it? Did I give the other key to that we just got right here? Or not? Before we send anybody, let's take a quick look. This is for sure the direction we're supposed to go here. Now try to lock pick with everybody. No. Can I keep just trying to lock pick it? No. Can't attack it either, even though we can't attack other doors. We have these keys. How do I even use the keys is the question.
All right, well, in that case, we'll switch back to him. Health potion. Potion of healing, I should say, and we're just gonna make a sprint for it. We are actually gonna enter turn-based. Don't have a choice, just gonna have to run through it. again. Just try to make our way out of it. And pop another potion of healing. here too. Cleric again, who's still stuck on this far side, which is great. Uh, we'll set a dash. Just have her run right through. Talk. Go ahead. I'm listening. Well, so we'll say, tell me a bit more about yourself. Let's see. I hail from Waterdeep, the city of splendors. I'm a wizard of considerable and scholar of exceptional accomplishment. I have a cat, a library, and a weakness for a good glass of wine. And if the mood takes me, I'm known to try my hand at poetry. There. All right. I'll say, you're trying to brush me off. Don't you have anything other than generalities to offer? Certainly. That I have a great respect for privacy, for instance, especially my own. All right, let's take another wisdom check here. Let's see how wise he is. 15. All right, we'll try it. 
Ah, didn't get it off. It's okay. Try as you might to breach his inner thoughts, Gale swats your efforts away with infuriating ease. I have a very disciplined mind. Those tricks won't work on me. Okay. Please don't try that again unless I invite you to. All right, we'll leave here. Interesting conversation nearby. Let's talk to our warlock friend over here. I was watching here. you at the Grove Gate. You spilled enough goblin blood to fill the Chionthar. Where'd you learn moves like that? Mm. All right, we'll go with the wizard and say, I studied for years to learn how to channel the weave. Years, huh? I never was the bookish type. Good thing I had someone to show me the ropes. You've got talent. If the blade must share his glory, better it be with a champ like you. All right. Well, so what about you? How did you become the Blade of Frontiers? It was a time I didn't amount to much. But then, uh, a higher purpose called to me. Killed a few goblins, freed a few captives, and I was hooked. The only life I want is a hero's. Now, let's get some rest. I do my best goblin killing at sunup. Okay, good to know. And we are going to sleep it off. Gale's just kind of hanging out there. That's all right. All right. Well, we did make it through. Everybody almost died, but we made it through. Actually, let's take a look and see if that trap is still triggered. Okay, so we'll avoid the fire room. I know there were other sarcophagi over there that we're not going to get to loot. Uh, I guess that's a penalty for walking into the trap, but that's okay. Not the end of the world. Keep marching forward. Armed scribes. No sign of a struggle. Hmm. I wonder what was so subversive about their words that they commanded protection. What do we have here? Granite bench. Well, let's see what these guys have. Scroll of burning hands, another quarter staff, some gold. Not a lot of much, but it's okay. Hole in the wall over there, too. Juggle. I didn't think anyone worshipped the scribe of the dead. Hmm. Scribe of the dead. It's okay, we'll keep moving. There it is. All right then. Hopefully we prepared turn on dead. Where the hell they compared to me? Something just woke up down here. Let them come. The darkness can be to our advantage. All right. That's okay. We'll hang out for a second. I'm gonna step just a step forward here with the wizard, and we'll end his turn. We're gonna try to get everybody out in front of him here. So hopefully he's not gonna take too many attacks. She'll stay here. She's gonna flank a little bit off to the side. I don't see any ranged weapons on them, so. Oh, okay. Silence, huh? Okay, well, we'll need to step out of that so we can cast spells. That is a problem. She'll step all the way forward. And actually, a little bit more than that, so hopefully my guy can stand there if she needs to. Let's see, do we have turn undead? Prepared. We do. And there's only ones close to us, but that's okay. We should get two of them back away from us. One of them saved, the other one did not. Okay. We'll end her turn. some of these guys down quick or they're going to start chewing us no. up. Alright. 
Now then, send our wizard down here. Ooh, yeah, never mind, that's right on top of us, never mind. Instead, we'll cast... Mm. Hey, burning... Oh, shocking grasp. Need that. We'll cast a race. That should be enough to deal with. He's got 28? Oh, there's only one that is 28. All right, the one who's turned does. All right, so we'll cast on one of the weaker ones. He's immune to poison. Didn't do any damage. Ooh, didn't think about that. All right, and then he's actually going to step back just a step. Can't reach it. Never mind. It's okay. We're in a decent spot. As far as she goes... Space, huh? Okay. I'm gonna move her out here. Uh, can we jump? I don't have enough speed. That's okay. We're about to action surge with her, so it'll be alright. We're gonna use our two handed sword. step out of the fire here for him. Um, hmm. Alright. Yeah, we definitely are in a bad spot. At least we got the heavy one out of the way. Not enough channel divinity for it. That's okay. Definitely we'll be good with this some radiant damage here, though. Target's too far. Target is too far. And he saved. This is going really poorly. Okay. Bonus action. Cast Healing Word on ourselves. Wizard. I don't have much of a choice but to step out of the acid. Blackius. One. Okay, well, at least it knocked him over. Alright. I don't have anything to cast as a bonus action, so he's just going to end his turn out here. He's going to attack again. Good. And we're going to send her along the top here. Yep, she's still good. She'll have her turn. him off. Now we're cutting him down a little bit. That's good. Oh, he rattles. Okay. He's still gonna run away from us. Good. Alright. Now... God, he won't. Actually, we'll save it. We're doing pretty well now. So instead... We'll do a, uh... Saber Flame. Okay, another fail. Just let her turn. Okay. We're gonna stick to cantrips now, because as long as we have the big guy turn, we'll be okay. Made a saving throw off the miss as well. Alright, onto the gith.
apparently that's it for his turn on dead. So now that it's our turn, he is about to catch set over here. Just to try to get in the way of that, he's about to catch the guiding bolt. So. Can I upcast that? at the second level, so that way we're going to try to get him out of here as quick as possible. 11's not bad. Okay. In the turn. Cool. We'll slow him down if we can with another uh, ray of frost. Another save. My DC's got to be incredibly low, but that's okay. Run up top. Just to get him out of the way. That she's gonna attack here. Mm, I forgot we still got the one on the ground. That's what I should have attacked, but that's all right. Now that our he's back up, uh, no need this misty step just yet. Ooh, that's not good. All right. In that case, he'll cast armor back and just keep himself alive. Alright, that should get him 10 extra hit points. And he will still engage there. Yeah, he's already burned his action, right? Yep, so he's a bonus, but we're not hexing. Okay. What is the plan here? Plotting next move. Okay, well, it's thinking about it. Alright, so he took some damage from hitting us, and he hit only our temporary hit points, so that's good. We're not gonna cast a second level spell, but I think we'll go back to Sacred Flame. Where's he at on health? Just 10. Yeah, see, there's an 8. Radiant damage is probably pretty good against these guys, so. Uh, she'll move next to him, but not really a whole lot of reason to. Ooh. All right, it's okay. Oh, it was only six. We're okay. Mm, yes. Actually, we're gonna go with magic. Let's just cast a first level spell on it. We'll send two to him, and we'll send one down here. Let's see if we can clear out all these guys. There it is. Perfect. Now, with that, we're dropping back, because I don't want any of that. And we'll leave it to the tank. Is that a miss? I guess that's a miss. Alright. She'll burn a superiority die. She's going to rally him and try to heal him again. Let's see if that helps him. Here. Three, okay. Plotting next move. What is there to plot? You're about to get run over. Hmm. Oh, I see. On ranged attacks, they have disadvantage. Cool. I guess he's just gonna pass, which is fine. Gonna run up here, and we're on a melee at this point. I know we kind of spam Ray of Frost, but this is definitely one of the better cantrips that I've got. Now let's see what they had. from the dead just to protect some dusty baubles. 
fools. I will say, couldn't agree more. Besides, what use do the dead have of possessions? Their trinkets may be worth a few coins all the same. Not a lot off these guys, though. Run up here just real quick. Take a quick look. Heavy key. All right. I think I might cast another... Hmm, might be a little early for it. Let's see, can we get in this way? No. I don't want to run through the acid again. Ah! Okay, come on. Oh, reduce his armor class by two. We'll be okay. Not a big deal. I thought that was going to do damage. Okay. A lot of effort to hide one sarcophagus. Fair enough. Wish there was a way to examine it beforehand. Oh, hey, man. I feel like there was meant to be sound there, but that's okay. So he has spoken. And so thou standest before me, right as always. What a curious way to awaken. Now I have a question for thee. What is the worth of a single mortal's life? Hmm. We'll say... Quite the question. What's the reason for it? Curiosity. Nothing more. Wilt thou answer my question? Say yes. Why not? So, I ask again. I know we're falling into traps because we're trusting too many people, but we're going to keep going with it. single mortal life? Right, each life is of infinite value and merits sacrificing everything for. And thus, balance is achieved. If all are at war, none can win. Very well. Oh, right answer. I am satisfied. We have met, and I know thy face. We will see each other again at the proper time and place. Farewell. How long has it been? You mind if I just like loot your... Hmm. Probably shouldn't have let him out, but alright. Okay, we'll take that. Hmm. I should read the plaque first, Here right? Lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. Okay. We'll open this. The amulet of lost voices. Very rare amulet. The dead hold no secrets from Jurgle's uh, scriveners of doom. Speak with uh, the wear of this item gains. Speak with dead. Level three. that to the cleric. I feel like that's a, well, yeah, we'll give it to the cleric. That way it might save us from having to take that spell later on, so not a bad, not a bad pickup. Again, the fact that we didn't get to pick our battle master's feats and we kind of jumped through my spells for level three, we'll have to be more careful with that because that is not good. Uh, but anyway, let's go into our inventory. We'll give it to her. Talk with equipment. Alright. Check these vases really quick. And we'll move on. Alright. Not a bad spot. Not a bad uh, find there. So that's kind of cool. Still comforting after all this time. Let's see if she can use 
use it. Yes, it is. Cool. Oh, it's this guy. He's still here. Okay. Anything else out this way? Doesn't look like it. Um, I know there was still the hole in the wall back this way. Oh, there's an exit out this way, too. Okay. We're gonna go back. We're gonna go back because I feel like... Maybe not. This is farther than I thought. I feel like there was an exit here somewhere. Yeah, here it is. We're gonna check down by the river here, at least. There's a ladder. Okay. We're gonna have to jump to it. Oh no, there we go. Let's take a quick look. Might just go right back down, but I get the feeling we're going to be... Chapel entrance, huh? Mm -hmm. Well, we, we can jump up here. What is that? We'll take a look. cool. We're up above. Oh no, never mind. We're not up above. We're right here in the middle. Just a little secret entrance to the tunnel that can get us in behind. Alright, well that's cool. That's good to know. Anyone that's going to pick this game up afterward, that's a good little tip that if you want to get in, uh, you could sneak your way over this way and get a free little entrance into the tombs. Not to mention you get to sidetrack around that, uh, that, that sarcophagus trap that we saw. Kind of locked us up for a minute. So that's a cool little spot. Are these guys about to get back up? I see damage on them. Continue on. Deeper into the crypt. I should really cast some sort of healing on okay, him, but I don't want to burn my only second level spell here. Chains. Bludgeoning versus, uh, yeah, versus slashing. So we'll we'll stick with the long sword. It's okay. Not... Okay, so C is how we do that. That's good to know. Go back to the cleric and let her lead the way. came down here looking for a druid. Doesn't seem like we're able to find him. Let's 
check the map real quick. We'll try the Gith Yankee, uh, or the Gith Patrol, I should say. There's Zevlor, okay. Goblin Camp is a long way out there. And so is the patrol. Okay. Let's check our journal real quick. Hmm. Okay. Just reading a little bit of this. Yeah. Alright, we'll continue on. I guess that's all for in there. Camp, or do we keep going? What's he got? What is he? Oh, he's ensnared in something. Okay. Now we're definitely going to take a long rest. We certainly are pushing it. If there is a time limit, we're not we're not starting very well. Great talent or not. No druid can cleanse an embedded tadpole. Give no credence to such fantasy. Entirely. I was as devoted to my studies as I was to my training. To all questions, the Kalir Library harbors answers. A gift from Vlakith herself that we may gain total understanding. Mm, we'll say that kind of wisdom is very valuable. Countless scholars roam the astral sea and beyond. Observing the ways of our lessers, exploring planes so distant, order turns to chaos and cold fires rage. The planes are ever quaking and their peoples ever shifting. The Githyanki possess an eternity of knowledge. Yet we still collect more, infinities upon infinities. We'll say, you look so unusual, get the anchor rare in these parts. I expect I am your first. <laughs> I know of Gith Yankee, but I've never met one. Of course you haven't. They would have cut you from navel to neck. You are no less alien to me than I am to you. I know of your kind, but I do not often encounter them. That large, fleshy nose of yours looks like a mistake. I was like, come on now, it isn't that large. Yeah, no, we'll, we'll kind of push back a little bit here. We'll go as if your upturned bat snout is any better. Better is an opinion, but mine is certainly more economical, disciplined, dignified. All right. How do you know so much about the Mind Flayers? We I know understand they fought each much other, but... beyond your comprehension. More to the point, I know the cure for our condition. It is imperative we locate a crash. You do well to observe more and question less. Uh, do you know what happens if we don't find a cure? Yes. Obviously we turn in into great them. detail. It starts with a fever and memory loss. Then you start to hallucinate. Your hair falls out and you bleed from every orifice. Your bones will change form. Your jaw will split to allow room for four great tentacles. All skin will turn to gore and be shed to reveal new flesh underneath. Then you have ceased to exist, and a mind flayer is born. All right. So that's not going to happen. We will find a cure. Words forged in steel. May your actions express the same metal. We must find my kind and be rid of the parasite. It's as simple as that. The first symptoms should have long since started, though. That is what puzzles me. All right, what do you suggest we do next? We follow the road west to the mountain pass. 
There will be a crash nearby. Then we may be rid of our parasites. All right, we'll leave. Take that rest. Still got Gale just chilling over there. Yeah, it's unfortunate it's the exact same uh, build as I've made, or very close to it, so. At least as long as we can only have four companions, no reason to have two wizards, so. If we pick up more, maybe we'll revisit and have a couple spellcasters, but don't think that's necessary when we only have four spots. Oh, we don't want to run through that. It's on fire. We'll go out and around. We'll just keep making our way west. I know we could go back to that village we found. Try to, uh... Assassinate that one chick that murdered the child with the uh, snake, but I don't think that's inc that's really necessary right now. We'll just go west. Again, we'll try to stay a little diplomatic as long as we can. We're not just gonna be like the party of murder hobos where we're out there just killing everybody every time somebody asks. We'll stay a little a uh, little more diplomatic. See if we can find a peaceful solution, and then if we can't, well, we can always come back. In the My forest. And my kin will understand we my here. need for servants. People up ahead. You, but only if I Something's ask. wrong. Let's go take a chat. You're a true soul. You can't die. Please, stay with us. I, I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. A strange symbol glows marked on their flesh, and something within you stirs in response. All right. Start with some medicine, say. His wounds look deep. I might be able to help. No, I can't. There we go. All right. He's hurt badly. An oil bear got him deep. If there's anything you can do... I'm watching you. The injured man locks eyes with you. A familiar squirming churns in your head. We'll hold the stare. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andrik and Brenner. New recruits. Yours to Shepard. Protect them. He is a true soul. Mind him. He will. He. He. Edwin. Ed. Please. He's with the Absolute now. You're. Mm, same as the goblins, huh? You're a true soul. Edwin, our brother. He was chosen. Like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. Mm -hmm. Say, so perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for the Druid Halson. I don't know any Druids. Okay. Explain this absolute to me. What? Are you... Are you testing us? Mm. The absolute is our know. goddess. She's going to rip down the old world order, start a new one. Then we'll be the ones with the power. Well... You will firstly, true soul. You don't need me to explain that. A true soul, like you, has been chosen by the Absolute. You speak with her voice, and when the time comes, the true souls, you, will rule. Pah! I will serve at no ruler's side but my queen's. All right. Why are you out here? The wilderness is dangerous. We're going to try to get you know a little more information, even though I almost sir, walked into it there. The Absolute sent us here. We're looking for fugitives. Survivors from that ship that crashed farther west of here. Okay. Forget the owl bear. You're still alive, so go. I'm not going to send them back after that. That'll get well, them killed. And, and just... Leave Ed. I suppose... I suppose he'd want us to go on. Find a way to honor his sacrifice. May the Absolute guide us. Okay. 
they're probably running off to their deaths, so good luck they to them. They spoke of the absolute. Same as that goblin Saza. Curious. Sounds like trouble. All right. Well, I don't think anyone's around. Shaft of a broken spear. We need that. The man is dead, but something shifts beneath his features. Here comes your eye stalk, right? Or your uh, your tadpole. A glistening tadpole emerges, slithering up past a sightless eyeball. The same as the creature behind your eye. Oh, do we crush it or do we observe it? Uh, let's observe. It seems to curl upward in recognition, then shrinks back down, eager to escape. Uh, I'm thinking we should crush it. Yeah, we're gonna crush it. One squeeze should do it. But you stop short. How could you think of harming something so beautiful, so pure? Well, we'll go inside here. Just enough. All right. The tadpole plops to the ground. Now is your chance to stomp it into the dirt. But it's too precious, too sweet, isn't it? We'll go, we'll go inside again. My con definitely isn't getting it. Strength is also trash, so we're gonna go inside here. It's a smart play. Oh, but we didn't get it. Uh, do we roll again? Yeah, why not? You raise your heel and crush the parasite into the ground. Intense regret washes over you, churning your stomach. All right. Continue on, I guess. I don't think there's anything out this way, is there? Oh, there is. There's another bridge. I'll take a quick look at it. I think we might be able to cross here. Traveler's chest, too. There's definitely blood on the other side, so this should be an ambush. Right? Definitely looks like an ambush. Yep, there they are. Well, these guys are alive. All right, let's walk into it. Why not? Let's just make sure it's this chick that well, well, we'll go with him. Or not. Thought he was okay. busy with the lads in Elson's Grove. Yeah, all right. Thought you were busy leading your crew. No, no, no. The contract didn't mention no goblins. I would have prepped the lads, brought better weapons. Let's say, what job was that? The kind that leaves half your crew dead. There's a wizard in Baldur's Gate that'll pay gobloads for a relic called the Night Song. But gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. Mm, let's say I want that gold. Where would I find the relic? It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you a map of the temple and wish you a happy funeral. But my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own sodger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. All I've got's the contract. Can show you where we turn back. If you feel like dying. I hear the Druid's leader went with you. As soon as he heard we had a contract to find that night song relic, he was more eager than a hound in heat. When the goblins jumped us, most of my crew scarpered, just like I taught them to. The old codger didn't. And you just left him to die. Here we go. Hand over the contract. Maybe I'll get the relic and save the druid. I'm just glad to be rid of the bloody thing. Happy hunting. Okay. I don't mind it. Y'all gonna be mad if I take all your stuff? Take that. I don't need all the clothes still. 
Same thing with the Goblin Scimitar, we're okay on that. Alright. We're still looking for the Druid, I'm gonna check the map. That is where I wanted to start, but... Let's see... Yeah, still nothing for him. He said he was underneath, though, so... Who knows? Alright, that's okay. Keep heading this way for now. More blood. Alright, let's go see what's up with Scratch. Mm -hmm. Reach out to pet him. Apparently not having that. Hard to tell with that. Mm -hmm. We'll go with animal handling. I don't think this is going to go very well because we're definitely not proficient. 50 50. Okay, we got it. There we go. The dog lowers his hackles, his head tilted inquisitively. Convinced that you're harmless, he turns his attention back to the corpse. The dog Adam. whimpers nervously, as if to urge you on. The dog looks at his owner with sad eyes. He does not move. All right, we'll hold out our hands so we can follow the our scent to camp. The dog sniffs your hand, his tail swung low in understanding. He knows how to find you. You get mad if I go through his stuff? Okay. Uh, let's read some letters then. Let's see what we got off this guy. Personal note. Romwick. Be doubly careful on the way back to Baldur's Gate. I've received more reports of attacks on travelers throughout the region. I can't have my best messenger winding up face down in a ditch somewhere. Watch yourself better late than never. Postmaster General Danzo. Alright. On to the next soft letter. Devin. It's a boy, he's healthy, and he's perfect. I've named him after his father. Come back and we see us soon as you get leave. Uh, love Flora and Devin Jr. Okay, obviously this guy was a mailman before he got wrecked. Let's check this tough letter. Nine fingers. I won't come back to the city. Not while you have your thugs looking for me. If you want the debt paid, you'll have to trust me and collect it yourself. Go to the graveyard and look for look for a M. Kerwin is buried. Get digging, you'll find enough valuables to settle, the matter, settle matters between us. Don't go looking for me. I'll, I'll know when I'm safe. S. All right. Oh, we'll continue on. Doesn't look like anything over there. We'll keep walking. Take a quick look, see if there's anything else. Says there's something up there. Ah. Okay. Let's see if we can go out and around. Is there somewhere we can go where we can make it across? So we'll keep that in mind, that that's there. Yeah. How would you punish someone who wronged you? Wrong me how? Oh, say, murder or theft. Killing is good. It calls the weak. But theft would be paid for painfully a thousand times over. Goblins ahead. Looks like they're left. Hmm. Good to know. All right. So we 
We got goblins up here. Where are they? Is this our camp? Maybe. Be alright. Get over there! Surround him like! Alright, I know you're there. Show yourselves. You spotted us. Good. It's like they say. No fun in skewing a pig what doesn't know he's cooked. <laughs> Curious, I almost had the exact same thought when I saw you. That's supposed to be a threat. Got a set on you, all right. Almost makes me like you. Almost. I'm gonna enjoy pulling off your skin when we're done. All right, I got first move. That's... About 10 health each. Should be a second one all the way on top, right? Oh, three of them up there, okay. Yeah, we're definitely gonna start with the mage. Nice. Natural 20. That is good. Same deal, he's gonna drop back. Get behind everybody. That'll do it for me. The problem is she has nowhere she actually needs to be up here. We're not just going to run her in there, so we're, we'll step back. Kind of lure them into a trap, I guess. She probably need to go back that far, but that's okay. I think she had a bow. I didn't see that one on the left. Critical hit, huh? Okay. See if I can miss a step up there. Perfect. Uh, we're going to go arms of Hadar here. Just take both of them. There we go. All right, 14. Not bad. The other guy makes a saving throw, but that's okay. He's a ranged character, and we are close. I should still have my movement. We're gonna get right next to him to threaten him here. Nice. Uh, I'm actually gonna go around the other side. There we go. He's not doing so great on health, but I don't have any health potions with him, I don't think. Let me check his inventory. Yeah, he's out. It's a bonus action to eat. Okay, that's alright. He'll end his turn. That was a pretty good turn out of him. Our other friend. She is beat up, no doubt about it. We'll start with a bonus action healing word. Get back on our feet. And we're just going to send her in to throw an attack. I know we're kind of leaving her out in the middle there. So we'll cast the we'll Boat Duplicity here. With our last spell. As far as the wizard, he needs to come back in to get a hit off. I don't think I'll need mage armor. I think we'll be okay. Mage armor is certainly something I need to start to get better at casting before these fights, but we'll step into the fire. It'll be okay. We got up here. We got 13 on a tracker, both of them. We're gonna go second level magic missile just to make sure they're out of here. Oh, we didn't kill him. That's not good. It's alright, though. And with her... Again, in this fight, she's not a whole lot of help. I know she has a bow. So we'll walk her back into the fire, I guess. Switch to our ranged weapon. Yeah, see, everyone's out of distance here. That's another shot. But... Oh, she got him. Alright, perfect. That's gonna do. Close him down. Actually, he's gonna cast nothing because he doesn't have a spell slot. He is in some trouble here. So 
So first... Over there, we'll go Eldritch Blast, see if we can finish him off. Nice. Alright. He's going to go... Just try to get out of range here, I guess. End his turn. There's more, oh, there's more of them underneath. Hopefully there's no range on that guy. Alright. She lost her duplicity because she was standing in fire. She's got a cast healing word, but I think he's out of range. Just out of range, right. Okay. It's alright, we'll move her. We'll cast healing word. Just to get him. Target is out of sight now. Sacred Flame tried to just knock this dude off the top. Too high. She does not have a lot she can do then. We're definitely going to save our second levels. Yeah, she just got her turn. Okay. We got our wizard up here. Him with the ray of frost or something too high as well. How do we do that? Six. Six is good. I don't know if we're actually hitting her. Let's hit her out. Go with the bow. Okay. Then we'll use second wind on her. And enter. Alright, glad we took that second wind. Our friend up here. He's gonna move right here. With our height is I think we'll be good. Strike him with Eldridge Blast. And just drop back. That way, if he's got a bow, it'll be harder to see him. Try to get a little bit closer. Healing spell. Where did that goblin go? There he is. Alright, cool. So we're not in bad shape. I know we're a little beat up, but we're not in too bad a shape. Can she see him now? She can. Alright, so she'll cast Healing Word. Take two. Just to get him off the ground. these other spells. Especially when we've got these other two. Still doing pretty well. Just a two, but that's okay. She's gonna try to rally our friend up this way. She can take some more health. Awesome. Alright. Wizard's gonna do his blasting. That kill. Apparently, that body's not gonna fall down there. He's just gonna get into range for our next goblin. Same deal. We'll move all along the top here. Back, so he sees only melee. And sacred flame. Intended. Save. Okay. We're still doing it in a decent spot.
save. Not the end of the world. We still got spells. He doesn't fall, but that's okay. We're gonna hit him with it again. Another miss. Yeah, no need to approach him, especially because he doesn't look like he has any range, so. These guys are saving like fiends right now. There it is, there's a 20. Alright. Waypoint discovered. Okay, cool. See if our friend can climb down from there without any issue. There he is. Thinking we're gonna take a short rest because I'm pretty sure I saw another guy walking around in here. First, we're gonna try to get up top. Just go through all their stuff. Yeah, so we do have enemies walking around. I should stop. Scrolls sitting around. Honestly, more than I was expecting to see. Ritual staff. Let's check my wizard and see if that better or worse. Looks about the same. Yeah, so. Take that. Take the scrolls too. I'm gonna distribute a few of those after we take a short rest. How's that do for my... Well met. I really need to do that. Okay. Switch over to him. this way. Oh, he's asleep. Awesome. Let's see if we can all just ambush him here. Start with Eldritch Blast. All right, that easy. Oh, don't don't follow him. All right, we'll go back here. We'll climb back down the safe way. I'm not sure why he decided the need. To jump off that, but hey, whatever. What's a couple hit points in this game? Honestly, that's been my biggest complaint. It's been very easy to inadvertently walk through things. There's another goblin up here, but that's okay. Is this less of a drop? Maybe a little bit? Say more, I just heard him. We should eat him, right? Check our bugbear as well as his box. Nothing in the box. How about our friend here? Emerald ring. Could be bad. There are a lot of them. Fly, 
It's been good. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Up here! Let me down! Keep chirping, birdie! <laughs> it's music to my... Well, I'll be... my old friend, Captain Failure. You! Sing for me, Roach! Tell me everything you know! <laughs> I know you ain't see it. <laughs> and there's an army of us, and just a couple of you. So you ain't the one gonna be asking questions. Your parasite burns in concert with Will's paralyzing rage and a hunger for answers. Stand with me, mate. Carve him up, but keep him breathing. I've got some questions to ask. Non-lethal, all right. Burn the answers from his shite-stained throat. Your man ain't tell you Spike clobbered his noggin and nicked his eye. Oh, it's the one holding his head. Nice to see you, Captain. Thought you'd burn with the other corpses. God damn you! You will point me to Spike, and then I will make you suffer! All right, let's give him a beating first. We can ask questions later. <laughs> Look at that! The captain grew some bollocks! All right. Of course, I walked the wizard right to the center of that. That's okay, though. Work out here. We're going to Uh, we're not. So we're not quite far enough in. Can he move anymore? No. Alright, well, now. And of course, I walk too close. That's where I'm going to have disadvantage on my range. That's not good. Let's go to my spells real quick because we lost the armor. That way, any of them attacking him should uh, should go down with that. And then we'll th also throw a hex on. Hex their strength. Okay. So we debuffed him. That's pretty good. Good miss. They're about to beat my wizard to death before I can do anything. So that's not that's not very good, but. Not the end of the world, the armor blocked that. Now that it's my turn. Best way to get around disadvantage. Should start with the range. I'm gonna throw them all at him. Good. We are gonna disengage just to get away. You have to jump to this gate, apparently, but okay. He'll drop back, end the turn. Blast, huh? Oh, okay. We'll have to keep track that that's the one concentrating on it. Good. Alright. Armor 8, most of that. Uh, that's 20. I'm not sure who ate the 20 on that, but alright. for a smash on him. There's somewhere for non lethal right there. Yeah, okay. Everyone's I'm gonna use healing for it actually. Take you. Ooh, good thing I did too. Alright. Um Oh, I think I killed him. 
That was not my intent. We're gonna action surge. Move up close. And we're gonna do it again. Nice. Okay. She's gonna move into range of this guy too. And we're gonna second wind with her just to make sure she doesn't die. Okay. It's a good turn. off the ground, get him his I don't need to detect the thoughts. Cast it. Oh, we can only cast uh oh obviously I don't have that restriction in this. Okay. Where's that devout again? Five on him. Gonna do another pushing attack. Good. Um, we don't have a bonus. Oh, we can rally. We need some health back. She's gotta be about out of those superiority die. Yeah, we're out. Okay. Knockout cockroach. I want him alive. I think we already killed him, buddy. Yeah. I'll 
much she can do is attack. We'll throw some poison damage on this thing with our main attack here. Close. Does she have a skull with her? I don't think she does, right? spread those out. Can I move them mid-fight too? That's not fair. He just won't. That's a really easy exploit, but that's okay. We're gonna skip that. Oh, what, another one down, huh? I get the feeling we're about to be in for a game over here. We're going for the kills too. Okay. Missile here, level one. Uh, and two, three. And I will move over here. Don't think there's anything I can do for that. about to be killed here. Not the end of the world. Only because we have those scrolls. The fail on her, so that is bad. But yeah, she's gonna end her turn. She can't do anything. She can't move. Looking good, not looking good at all. Better they attack me instead of attacking her. Yeah, see, I knew they were gonna do that. I almost it's not even worth resing here. Oh, did they have a fire arrow too? Yeah, it's not even worth resing him. Go with another magic missile, just so we're sure these don't miss. We can't afford any misses at this point. We're gonna give him all three, make sure we get the kill. We've gotta start not cutting their numbers down. We're drinking our healing potion. We're gonna wait here. I have one more first level spell, so... Good hit. 11 ain't bad. And that's gonna have to do it for her. Okay. So, yeah, at that point, we're going to use Magic Missile. We're going to send two here. Make sure we get that kill. We'll send another one over there. We did get it. Okay. Even though they hit a saving throw. Not the end of the world. And then I'm just going to move up here, actually. We're going to try to get into range with this Goblin Archer. And I can't jump right now. Same idea. I'm gonna split up. They should be out of luck here. I'm probably gonna need her to come help, but. Yeah. Hmm. Good thing. And all I can do. Him. Just gonna try to knock him over. Nice. Should make it harder for him to run away. Then we'll send her back out this way and get this last kill. Damage 
bridge here since he just got up. Right back up, go beat his ass. Nice. All right, now let's go use those scrolls here. Just walk down here. I don't like burning two of these this early in the uh, in the campaign, but it's got to be done, I think. And there they both go. Damn it all to the hells! I wanted to knock him out, not kill him. He could lead me to Spike. You owe me answer to a spike. the goblin that ripped my eye out. And I've got reason to think he's holed up in their camp. Okay. I'll fill in the rest later. Now, let's get that gnome down before he bursts a vein. Dark secrets. Vengeful urges. Don't leave me in suspense just as you threaten to become interesting. You heard her will, what else aren't you telling us? You want the full measure of the blade? Take me to Spike. All will be laid bare. Okay. A grease bottle and a great axe. We're gonna take both of those. We're gonna give that. A friendly Gith Yankee. Uh, where is it? She's definitely going with that great axe. And we're going to two-hand it. Yep. Perfect. Time has dampened the spear's sheen, but uh, the center glows a faint blue. The magic it exudes feels old, terrible, and divine. The spear was given to its previous owner for his unerring loyalty even after death. It's dippable, can't dual-wield, two-handed. Yeah, I don't see a difference here, though, is the problem. Oh, well, I guess it's better than a mace, so we'll give her. No, she's got to give up the shield, so we'll keep the mace. Help. All right, let's go help this guy, and then we'll take a rest. And I know I should just be hoarding all this stuff, but I'm not that worried about it. See if the devouts have anything. Yeah, see they've got spells. Scrape wood shield. Not really that interested in it. Same thing. This is same as a typical mace. We'll leave that be. Let's see when he comes back around. Maybe we go in the back. 
Can we get in here? Oh, we can. Okay. You should take the ladder up, I guess. Try eating a little bit of food. That is one thing we haven't done yet. Did that actually heal him? A little bit. Okay. Not enough to make it worth it, though. Not really, anyway. How do we shut this off? Maybe something down low? I don't think attacking is the right idea. Is this it? No? Break lever. And he's probably still way up in the air, right? I have to time it. came out. Oh, wait, I guess dragged him down to the bottom, because I was going to say, if we have to time that, that would be a problem. Cut me loose! Free What's me in it for me? And find out! Oh, Maga Kamara. Those pustulant thugs! Well, get on with it. I say we'll get on with what? You saved me, now you'll extort me. That's how this works, yes? Mm, we'll say I'd rather know how you got caught. Again, we'll play it nice. Uh, my own fault, really. I should have dropped my pack and outrun those bastards. Uh, take my pack, if you can find it. The only reason those goblins caught me was its weight. I'll travel lightly from now on. Uh, you're a little far from home for a deep gnome. Ignorance is alive and well, it seems. Deep gnomes aren't restricted to the Underdark, you know. I've lived in Baldur's Gate for All years. Right. I'm in search of a friend. I fear he's in trouble. See this? I gave it to him years ago before I left home. I found it around the neck of a thug in the lower city. It was speckled with blood. My friend, nowhere to be found. But I still have hope. I'm heading to his home in the Underdark to discover what happened. I always help my friends. On that note, <clears throat> I bid thee farewell. If we should meet again, well, we will have met again. Hmm. Okay. Uh, definitely time for a long rest because we have burned everything. Let's see if anyone has anything interesting to say. Doesn't look like it. Oh wait, we got one. Take one. Dragon's breath brandy <laughs> puts hair on your bones. Now eh, we'll take a sip. Baldurian, Dragon's Breath. Sorry about all that. Uh, back at the windmill, I mean. I lost my head. You ever felt so much hate, it poisoned your blood. I felt a grudge or two. None of them ever ran that deep, though. Then you don't know the sickness that spreads through me. 
I crossed paths with Spike a few years back. He had torched the whole village, left it to burn. I wasn't a blade then, just a kid, really. Should have known better than to run hollering after a goblin bruiser on a rage high. Hmm. You better take another sip of that brandy. Take another sip. Down the hatch. Spike went right for the eye. Last thing I saw was the dagger coming at me, woke in a puddle of piss and blood. <laughs> I reckon he thought I was dead. I wasn't dead. From anger and sorrow, I was reborn. I was the blade of frontiers. I will see Spike dead. I will see the land cleansed, and I will keep its people safe. Revenge quest? I wouldn't miss it for the world. You hear that, Spike? <laughs> the blade's coming for you. And he won't be alone. Alright. We'll take a rest. Yes. Alright. Not everybody's still alive. We're gonna take a couple. We're gonna split the scrolls, I think. Yeah, we'll split it. Give one to him, and we'll leave one on the cleric, I guess. Okay. Some shields. Candle. Really worth a whole lot. Let it go. Okay. Keep making our way. Let's take a quick look at the map. Okay, we're actually heading the wrong way, but that's all right. Or well, we might be going the right way. Hard to say. What do they? Hello? I feel like I missed something, but okay. Can't really do anything about that. This feels like a trap as well. We gotta be careful crossing this bridge. The goblin camp, huh? Do we just walk up and talk to him? I feel like that's gonna trigger an attack. Next time! Gribble be on guard duty. He's the right boss. Grib couldn't guard his nose from his We're fingers. Getting curled out their cranks. Ain't fair. Hmm. All right, we'll leave it. At least till we get that goblin out of the cage. that. Hmm. Like crossbow. Should carry it as well, but I don't think there's a whole lot of use for it. I mean, my other characters already have a bow. At least everyone that's going to be proficient with it, so I don't think we're going to use it. By all means, leave if I am so distasteful. I'd rather not turn my back on you. If it's all the same. There's Spike and the old priestess gut. Zevor. Still not sure where everything else is, huh? Alright, in that case, we'll go back to the village. And we'll go get, uh, go get the goblin out of the cage. What did that just do to my camera?
that is not something we need to talk to. At least not yet. We're going to need more experience before we get there. Let's avoid the Blighted Village. Fast travel on out of here. Let's go back to the cliffs. second just to review my prepared spells. Okay, okay. I don't really feel like we need that. The level 2 sleep could be good. 32 hit points. I could put, well, maybe two or three of them out. We'll take that instead of Ray of Sickness. Well, We'll take it instead of Thunder Wave. Thunder Wave hasn't done me a whole lot of good to this point. So we'll take level 2 sleep. Nah, I need one up close. So we'll get rid of Ray's sickness for now. Okay. 18 meters on that. That's. It doesn't really seem like there's any reason to cast it at level 2. Go take a let's take a look over here by the ship again. Let's go out this other side. Oh, here we go. Harry, I've got one of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? Say, so kill it yourself. You look capable enough. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. Uh, we gotta go Dex. to keep that lovely neck of yours in one piece. Hmm? Now, I saw you on the ship, didn't I? Nod. Not here. Splendid. And now you're going to tell me exactly what you and those tentacled freaks did to me. Uh, We'll say you have it backwards, they took me prisoner just like you. Don't lie to me. I... Ah! Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm, the light, the fear. Uh, what was that? What's going on? Uh... We'll whisper a cantrip to burn his hand here. Yeah, well, we'll see. There we go. All right, hit it. Ah, damn it! I saw into your mind. They took you. Just the same as me. And to think... I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. Mm -hmm. Say, glad we're all caught up now. Indeed we are. Please, allow me to introduce myself. My name's Astarion. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. All right. Baldarian Is that so? Too. We clearly move in different circles. So, 
Do you know anything about these worms? Uh, yes, unfortunately. They'll turn us into mind flayers. Turn us into... <laughs> of course it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although... It hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. <laughs> control it, we need to get rid of it. Well, yes, of course. But first things first. You should travel with me, our odds are better together. Tempting, but your party seems a little... Uh, crowded right now. I like to have my space. All right, you're welcome at my camp then. I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't a bad idea. Safety in numbers, after all. And I hate to turn down an invitation. All right. Maybe I'll see you there. Good luck. We'll have to see. If he is a rogue, I think we'll switch out the warlock for him. Take a look at this, I guess. Ah, that was obviously his pod. Put out here. Oh, okay. Stranded Fisher. Seen enough blood today, all right? Okay, we'll talk to this guy. Umberly, speed you on your way. Won't trouble you any further. Okay. How about you? Please, get oh, away. Guys before. Okay. We're building a raft. We'll bloody swim if need be. Just leave us be. Oh, forgot about you guys. It's okay. Nothing else around here, it doesn't look like. Let's go take a look at this door again. See if uh, either of those keys I scooped up from underneath help us with that. the door and see that everything was burning? Okay. Alright, well, short rest. Everybody's health back. No big deal. Back to the Druid's Grove here. Which is not that way. That way's on fire, so we'll go out this way. Take the long way around. The walking speed I do wish was a little bit faster too. With the size of this map, I understand they're not trying to have you jump all the way through it, but would be a little bit better if I could just click and have them travel a distance.
for some people to be looting. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Love some power, huh? Blessed by priestess gut, these gauntlets aid anyone who, uh, who bear the absolute mark upon their flesh. But woe would any non-believer hopes to seal their power. Absolute, the wearer of this item gains absolute bane. Creatures hit by an attack may receive d4 penalty to attack rolls and saving throws. Don't need the great axe. Not really interested in the skulls either. Well, it still says there's something to do down here. Take a quick look at the journal, too, while they're moving. Mm, rescue the Druid Haslin. Let's see where he's at. some dignity and leave. You've burdened this place with your troubles long enough. Nice talking to you too. Did it say there was something else going on here? Apparently not. Let's check the map. the goblin out. Maybe we can add her to the party as well. We'll see. Not certain that uh, we're going to be able to trust her, but it doesn't matter. We'll roast her if we need to, but pretty sure we're not going to be able to trust her. Well, let's go. We should have stopped her. killed one of the two. Oh no, there it is. Alright. Running out of time, walk me. My family will be here soon. Let me out! <laughs> Even if you did find my tribe, they'd set the walks on you need me. Get me out of here, and I'll tell them what a good friend you are. Then hurry up and do it. My tribe ain't as friendly as I am. Just be patient, well, I'll break you out free and I've got all the time in the world. You don't. Mm. Alright, well, we'll let it go. I'm not gonna, just going to break her out, I guess. I don't I don't think it's a quest, is it? Alright. Well, fast travel back. Everybody is bunched up, which is something you can't really do anything about, so... 
That's awesome. It's alright. Give me a shot. Somebody will burn a uh, die to kill him. Ignis. Doesn't matter. All right. And his turn. He should be rallied here for a second. I guess I'm gonna burn another one of these. Take Use on him since he's about to miss a step through the door there. In her turn. Dashing. Who knows what that was about? Same thing, dash. Now 
that's over with. That was the most frustrating battle in history, but that's okay. Alright. And I guess we'll leave the old blighted village after we take another short... Oh, we can't take a short rest. Hmm. Yeah, we're about to camp, because I don't want to get fried. Or not. Now you've done it, goblin. Or, now you've done it, trespass. Okay. off. Well, who knows which one that just was. It's alright. She's at the end of the round, so that's fine. Back to the wizard, who's gonna use Thunder Wave on this. But it saved its throw, so it's not moving. Just straight disengage, it looks like. We can jump out of here. <laughs> this is actually be more serious than I thought. The spider's pretty hefty. Probably gonna knock the cleric in this hit. Let's see how much damage it does. Oh, it's just not gonna move. Okay, I'm I'm good with that. Main hand attack, just at the 60. There's blast at worst, yeah. With it being range, it makes sense that it's harder to hit with. Nice. Stuck next to somebody. And turn there. Alright, we got fair order to do about this thing. It's guiding bolt. That's not good. Alright. She is engaged with it too, so I can't leave. Alright. Just hammer it. So hopefully we don't die in one turn from this thing. That's good. Okay. Back to the wizard. He's gonna use magic missile again. All four of those. Spider plans to do. 
He's got to attack the cleric here, right? I don't think he's going to run by it. If you're smart, you go for somebody that's hurt, but... We'll see what it does. I don't know. Obviously, it's confused from the summoning. It hasn't done anything. That's okay, though. We'll take advantage of that. Done! Push him back closer to the companions. She'll try to hammer again. Okay. And she'll use heal word. Take you. Just a four, but that's okay. Back to the wizard. She's gonna start attacking the spider. Yes. the goblin I wasn't thinking. But he just deserved this girl, so I guess we'll him. This is what was I saying? Should I still get him with him? Okay. Pretty needy hit. I wonder what I did for damage on that. Should just run back over this way. do some damage from the area. Symbol. Can't investigate it though. Hmm. Alright. Now let me run this one. Shadowheart's attention is fixed on a damaged old helmet. We... we should keep moving. What just happened? Nothing. The trick of the light. But something tells me there might be a solution to some of our problems hiding in this wilderness. All right. There's something else you want to say, I'm listening. No. No. You'll understand when you see it. Let's go. All right. Be vague. are not hostile. Let's save just so we don't get wrecked. And second thought, no. Oh, okay, I see. You can pull the party apart, right? Maybe not. Thank you. 